Let's go to Jason, though. He's a Man United fan, right, Jason? Hi, Jason. Yeah, Jason. All right, matey. Yeah, I'm just speaking to you, Jason. I don't want to um, speak to the grinning <laughs> Cheshire cat over there smiling <laughs> his face. I'm not, I'm not watching on YouTube, so I'm just, I'm just talking on the it's phone. And that. Come on, yeah. Jason. You've got, you got to take him on the no, chin, no, no, mate. Just, at the end of the day, um, last day, Jace, do you remember when you won the European Cup in 2012? <laughs> I know yeah. where you're going with what this was one. That, what was that feeling? That, yeah, it was that, that sensational. And 21. And, and, and 21. Uh, yeah, yeah. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> and I, I say I wasn't round in 68. Probably Jammy was there, yeah. but um, he probably went to 66 World Cup. But... Um, um, he's just uh, no, it's, it's just these Spurs and the Audi fans. Cup mate it was no, a good, no, good listen, trophy listen, that no, one pal. I, I listen to these Spurs fans and it's just like saying my best mate's a Spurs fan my uncle's a Spurs fan and they, and, and they think it's Pele's Brazil against Port Vale and then before any Spurs fan especially if Jamie says Oh, who's it, it, Port Vale? Yeah, well, Jim, Jimmy Greaves said that once, the, the legendary Jimmy Greaves. Yeah, yeah, I've cried my eyes out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you, United were garbage yesterday, and it's just said, uh, but I've got TalkSport exclusive for you now, so you can cut the crime music out go now. Go, go on. Do you, I, I tell you, I'm going to tell you, uh, I'm going to tell you um, Tottenham and Oxford's next manager is going to be. Go on. It's going to be Eric Temp Place. Jeez. I mean... Jeez, Jace. It's not the best one. Jace, come on, come mate. mate. No, no, come, come on, what's on, going on in your club? On. Tell it, us, it, Jace, it, what's it, happening, matey? No, what's... no, 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 it's won back-to-back trophies. And Spurs would love a League Cup and an FA Cup. And then he'd he, he, he remind you, Jace, we've won two trophies. <laughs> so there you go. It's who we are, mate. Yeah, exactly. So, uh... Let's just talk about your team, Jace. Stop talking about the mighty Spurs. All right, you've no, got no, pumped. No, well, Let's you, talk you about your team. Right. You know, you've well, got you've you got you've got I, I, folded. You folded I, I, like a deck of cards in a big game. Have you have you requested an open buzz top top tour? Oh, come on, like, come on. Let, you you are in the mud right now, Jace. You're in the we mud. We garbage. We garbage. Uh, so let's Jamie, talk I, about I, it. I, what are you going to do about Jamie, it? What are you going to do? I, I, I phone you up and all that, and then you you, you have a go at me. <laughs> have a go at Eric Tenag and all that. Oh, sorry, I, I call him Eric Ten Place and all that, but. <laughs> End of the day, I, I said this all along. I went a game last season. Uh, it was when we got beat by Brighton at Old Trafford 3 0. I, I said to my mate who I went with, I said, he's lost the dressing room. Did not want to play for him? Yeah, he can boast about he won the FA Cup against Man City. I keep telling you this, but it's just, um, end of the day, he's, he's lost the dressing room. But I think the blame should fall on um, Jim Rackley's um, door because he, he decided to keep faith with him and all that. And, well, that was a big uh, mistake. Yeah, exactly, exactly, Jace. I mean, I've I've just been well, like, hey, listening so, to uh, the problem the you've got, Jace. Today, Jace, yeah. the problem you've got. The problem, Jim Ratcliffe, I say it's a big mistake. At the time, if there is no one you feel is good enough for the job, don't jump. And it's basically like Eric Tenog, bet the devil you know. But I th- all they've done is by giving that year's extra contract on top of the one he yeah. had, all they've yeah. done, and everyone knows it. The players know it, the fans know it, Tenog knows it, Sir Jim Ratcliffe knows it. Everyone knows that they're just kicking the can down the road to make a big decision when someone comes along they really feel can do the job. That's the situation that United are in, and everyone knows it. Jace, you said it, you said it yourself. The club's rotten to the core, mm. and it is rotten. To the core. I bet I've been saying I, I've been phoning up for years when, like I say, when you were like Mr. Goldstein at, on Talksport. Mm. The, the problems, like I say, it, it, it's cancerous, and it's just um, it, it's just going to keep going on until it, it gets sorted. I mean, I say. Pe- Pair of you just probably want Eric Tenag to sign a ten-year contract. Keep him there, mate. Keep him there. He's top manager. <laughs> top manager he is. Love his style. Yeah. Love his identity. Well, well, well done, Brazil. Well done, Brazil. For beating Man United at Old Trafford. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry, mate. You'll be hearing all the Spurs fans phone up, yeah. gloating about what they're going to do. Yeah, yeah. yeah Let's go to uh, Jace. Cheers, matey. Let's go to GJ. He's a Spurs fan, all right? Hi, GJ. There he is. How you doing, boys? You're right. I'm all right, GJ. mate. I'm all right. Um, you enjoy that at the weekend? Oh, Jamie, my man. How good was that, eh? Yeah, top draw, mate. Top draw. It's been coming. A whooping's been coming. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I've been, I've been a critic of Angie's tactics, as you know, right? But I've got to give the man his flowers here. That was a brilliant, brilliant performance. Mm. Um, you know, I've got to say, unless you're Arsenal, West Ham or Chelsea... We've got to be everyone's favourite team because we are the great entertainers. We're, we're kind of like Kevin Keegan's Newcastle. Jay, we cre- GJ. Cre- GJ. Yeah, we are yeah. the great entertainers, GJ. GJ, right. Jay, what are you talking about? What are you, well, what, right, what, what are you right. Talking? We, 
we create so many chances and we give up so many too. So we're so good on the eye. So you like that part of it now? You enjoy no, that? No, no. What, what yeah. happened three weeks ago? <laughs> no, hear me out. What I've said, yeah. I've got to give the man his flowers, right? However, what I was going to say was, um, I will judge us properly when we play streetwise teams like Liverpool and your mob, because those those teams are smart enough to sit back and sucker us on the counter. But, but well, GJ, you just said we're the most entertaining team in the world. If I remember rightly, three weeks ago, you said this. I've been saying it for months about, you know, Ange imposter no clue. He, he's a fraud. <laughs> <laughs> Imposter, no clue. He's a fraud. DJ, everything's recorded on this show, pal. Uh, no, no, no. Right, okay. As I said... <laughs> all right, you've done me there. You've done me, <laughs> you've done me good, mate. All right, look. All, all I'm going to say, I, I, I like to be fair, right? I like to be fair. And like I said, I'm going to give the man his flowers here. That was a great performance. We we bossed them. We suffocated them, didn't we? They couldn't get out. Look, look, look GJ, GJ, it was a really good Spurs performance, right? But yeah. you're playing against a side that's at rock bottom. I would be very careful about how far you go because it wasn't that long ago. You were saying to him, Ange Imposter, no clue. That's what you called him. You're, that's your words, not mine. Yeah, yeah no. D- D- Jason, my man, Ange Imposter, no clue. <laughs> right? You're absolutely right. And this is why I did say, literally about a minute or two ago, I said, I will judge us properly when we play streetwise teams like Liverpool and Chelsea. Right. Well, bit is, um, bit, yeah, this, right now, I yeah, I no, this, there ain't many. I mean, other than Southampton, right now, a team that's rock bottom. Other than them, Man United mm. are absolutely in. My, they've got, by the way, they've got they're Porto. Right. They've got Porto away on Thursday. Then they're away at Aston Villa. Oh, they're gone. Um, I, mean, uh, I mean, I think in international break, he's gone. Yeah, I think yeah. you're right, mate. Yeah. He's gone, that'll mate. Come, that'll come. He can't last. No, unless, I'm sorry, yeah, you can't keep. I'll, you can't keep putting in these performances and getting away with it and saying that we have a, a, a process and a plan, a clear plan. There's no plan at Man United with him in charge. No, no. He's just yeah. kicking the can down the road, as yeah, Cundy yeah, says. Yeah. They are gone. Emery, Emery's going to get rid of him. Yeah. They'll, beat, they'll beat Man United and that'll be the end of Ten Hag. GJ, we've got to talk about Brennan Johnson. Great little resurgence from him. Four goals on a bounce. You know, people yeah. have been digging him out. He's took a bit of stick, but... He's answered his critics very, very well, and now he looks like a player who everyone wants in his team. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it, it's so good to see because, I, you know, I don't like it when we dig out our players um, well, on, gonna... online and that. I'm, I'm not a fan of that. And also, I've got to, we, let's dig it up for Solanke as well because he is... Well, when Son plays in that centre-forward position, he can't smell a goal like a centre-forward can. And you watch Solanke, he's always in around the goalkeeper. Mm. He's waiting, he's waiting he for a rebound. In. Yeah, he follows things in. He does, Just he's really good at thing, it. Just one more thing, Jamie, right? Just one more thing. Cool. I was going to say, I reckon Van der Ven should be our captain, you know. I, I think he's our best player, and I think he's our most important for Angeball, the way the system is. He's unbelievable. Yeah, he is unbelievable. I'll yeah, go as far top. to say he's probably mate, the best you. centre half in the world I, right I, now. I, look, I'd have him, mate. He's, there aren't many better than him and Saliba f- for right now. And you, everyone mocked me saying about, all, you know. He's better he, than Saliba. Come on, mate. He's got way more than Saliba. Mate, right now. Come on. Right don't, now. Don't compare no, him to Saliba. Right now, right now, Saliba, I think, is probably the best centre half in the country. Right no, now. He's proven don't, it. Do me a favour. He's proven favor. it, right? He's proven it. What do you mean he's proven it? Don't, don't, don't. What do you mean he's take, proven take it? Take your Spurs hat me, off. Right. Take I, his, I, there's no take, Spurs hat on. Take your Spurs. Tell me what, what Saliba's no, proved that no, Van der Ven hasn't no, proved. No, no, take your hat. No, honestly, don't get like this, Jay. No, I know it's I'm Arsenal. Not, no, try to on. be balanced. No, but come on. They've conceded four have, goals in two games. Try to let's have... Not, let's, you know, let's hold on a minute. Try it, to have a Saliba's bit of balance. brilliant. He's fantastic. Don't get try. me wrong. He's a great centre-half. But don't tell me oh, think, Saliba's proved it. Well, he ain't I, won nothing. I, I, think, I think right. Van de Ven I, is... is Better than Saliba right now. Well, that's your opinion, right? But just because it's Arsenal, they're getting all vicious no, and nasty, just don't come out foaming and give me at that, the mouth. That rubbish. I'm no, a fan of Saliba's Van der Ven. I, w- so is Van der I would. Ven. Ra- I'm a fan of Van, as you well know. But come on, mate, just say well done, Arsenal. They're, they're chasing another. T- just, 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 just go and say well <laughs> go done, on, Arsenal. Mate, what's the matter no? with you? They beat Honestly, you the other day. They whooped you the other why day. Why did you have to bring up Arsenal? You did. What? I said Saliba and you couldn't take it. Well, exactly, you brought up Arsenal. So, don't don't compare him to Saliba. Like compare him to you I, know, I like, Van Dyke or I like Van you know, De, I like or, Van Der Ven. 
You know, bit, Rudiger fan, and Real Madrid, big fan, or, right? You know, like a big, top, like a, a, a top centre half in the you, world. You just put Saliba in there, like this is, Saliba's a really good player, yep. a, a top player. Yes, but yep. oh, let's calm yeah. down a little bit. Arsenal ain't won nothing yet. So, yeah, you know, I think no, Van Dijk no. would have something to say about you know, well, you, you, you know I, when you're comparing the best centre halves in the world. You mentioned you Saliba. I told you my thoughts, right? Come on, man. Van horrible. de Ven is the best centre half in the world right now. Right now, on form, I mean, he is. Jay, he, is Jay, he walks Jay. into any team. He gets in Liverpool's team. Jay, he gets in I'm Real Madrid's I'm team. A fan. I'm a he fan. gets in Man City's team. Right. He walks into I'm any team in the world. But right now, if you gave the me the Saliba choice, play over Rudiger. Right, right now, I said the league. Right now, the league. The best, the best Premier League defender right now. No, Jay, don't, don't get all, don't get all funny no, with me, Jay. You know, like, come on, Jay, come don't. on, mate, it's, come it's on. Arsenal, look at you. No, mate, look. come on, come it's on. Still hurts the other day when you said you were going to get whooping. Come on, mate, whoopy. <laughs> you know, you can talk about best centre halves in the world. Let, you know, Saliba's, you know, one of, but don't talk about him as the one that we compare other centre halves. No, I said to. in the league, for me, Saliba. Best defender, best centre half in the league. Well, not Van Dyke. No, I've told you that. I've given my thoughts. Right. Saliba, right? So it's up to you with you. Jay, don't get. Oh, look at him. Look, look. Man, just his, wind me look up. at him throwing his arms oh. up. Throw, look. Van der Ven walks into any team I'm, in the world. I, walks into. I like Van der Ven. I've said this to you, right? I'm a huge fan. But if you had to ask me now, which one is the best defender in the league, centre half? I'm going to sleep. And that's it. So look, don't, don't, you, you, don't give me daggers. So you you give didn't say that. Mate, I'm giving give you evils because I'm evils. sure when I sat down with you the evils. other week, you evils. said Van der Ven's the best centre-half in the week. I, you you, you I changed said, like the wind, I mate. said the you contradict We yourself. put the two together. It was Saliba and Van der Ven when you put an Arsenal and Spurs 11 together. That was my, my centre-half pairing. Don't get all funny. Look at you. Give me evils. I'm not having that, mate. I'm not having it. Van der Ven's number one. Uh, right, keep your calls coming in. 03 717 4 the Sports Bar with Jamie O'Hara and Jason Cundy. Monday to Thursday nights from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.